your girl picked up a new palette you guys so we're going to be playing in some makeup today and i've got this awesome new wig from amazon to show you so if you want to see how i transform make sure you stay tuned <music> So you guys may already know Beats by Deb. I have been following her for a really long time. She is a beautiful, beautiful chocolate girl makeup influencer on Instagram. And she recently came out with this collab palette with Playing in Makeup by Yolando. And it is a super, super, super vibrant palette. I kind of think this is better than James Charles palette because I never picked it up because it never stood out to me. But when I saw that she came out with this palette, I had to get it because she is known for her colorful, super colorful, vibrant looks. And here I am swatching the palette because you guys know that on darker skin tones, colors don't tend to be pigmented enough for us. So I'm swatching this on my fingers with absolutely no product on my arm and you can see exactly how vibrant this palette is on my skin tone. I was blown away you guys. So shout out to these queens for making this collab happen. This is much appreciated. Even though I don't wear a whole lot of colorful looks anymore, it still helps and gives me a little peace of mind to know that I have something I can pick up whenever I'm in the mood to be a little bit more vibrant. Since this is just an eye look, I went ahead and did my face. These are the products I'm using. I'll make sure to list those in the description box below. Here's a closer look at what the palette looks like and the color options you have. I want to note that there are a lot of options for transition colors here. You gotta have a nice beautiful chocolate brown, you gotta have your blacks, you gotta have those dark tones so that if you wanna deepen up and create more definition, that option is there for you. So I really appreciate them for putting that in the palette along with all of the beautiful vibrant colors. It kind of also gives you the option to do some neutral looks as well. So this will be a good palette to take with you when you're traveling. For this look, I kept it real, real simple. I basically started with the darker tone greens on the outer corner, used that brown as a transition shade, and then, then I went up a few levels of green as I got closer to the inner corner. That's really it in a nutshell, y'all. Nothing special here. I really like how the eyeshadows blend out. They're very, very soft and a little bit goes a long, long way. Then I also put some of that blue teal on top of it because I wanted it to match my outfit um, to give it that teal green color. Now for liner and lashes. These are the lashes I use today. I picked these up at my local beauty supply. If I can find it online somewhere, I'll be sure to link them below. And of course, with a look like this, you got to highlight y'all. So grab my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit. Can't live without it. Now on to the start of the shoe. I picked up this wig from Amazon. Now let me tell y'all something about my relationship with wigs. I really don't care for human hair wigs and I'll explain why. The reason why I don't care for human hair wigs is because human hair behaves like regular human hair. If you curl it, there is a 85% chance that that curl is not going to last through the evening. So. I have a tendency of picking up synthetic wigs. Actually, a lot of the wigs I've worn in the past year or so have been synthetic, but they have been making these wigs so good, you guys, that you could barely tell. I kind of wanted to go back to black and see how I looked with it because I've been rocking the blonde for so long. And I am still practicing and trying out this middle part thing. I am, it's taken me some getting used to, but I noticed that when I take pictures, it looks freaking amazing. So. I'm gonna keep rocking it out as long as I can. And I don't know if you guys were able to see the lace. The lace on this bad boy is pretty awesome. Like, y'all can't even tell that I didn't glue this down, can you? Mm-mm, I sure didn't. Matter of fact, I wore this for a whole week, took it off every night, I sure did. So that is it for the video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this look and this new wig, sister. Super affordable. 
thank you again beats by deb and make sure you like the video on your way out subscribe if you want to see more content like this and i will catch you in the next video bye